says the fire alarm has gone off. I'm Sophie and welcome to my YouTube channel. Mm -mm -mm. I'm only about 13 years late for this platform, but there's a reason. This is this entire thing I'm gonna be posting weekly is for my mother. Mom, now when you ring me up every single day and ask me for a detailed step-by-step -step what I've done, I'm just gonna be like swipe up the link, babe. Do you know what I mean? So here it is and hope you enjoy it. And also like I just wanna like document my life so I can look back on it because like oh, you've all seen my Instagram stories and they're just like really bad quality and like you can't save them so let's get let's just go okay love you bye okay so I'm doing a live class for Zoella's internal team yeah that's a plan I'm a bit nervous and also it's like so early in the morning and it looks like I've literally just rolled out the shower which is the truth and does my hair look wet or greasy we look greasy. We um, just had an article come out about us last night. The, the title is um, The Empowering Reason Why Thousands of People Send This Woman News. Sophie T is taking the body confidence in the art world by storm. Oh my god, I have to read that later. Oh my god, it's so long. Hey, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Oh, thank you. Book for that. Hello. Hello. So I guess I'll just introduce myself first. I'm Sophie T, for all of you that don't know. Um, I'm a painter and I have been painting now for five years. I started, I did a business degree. I was traveling in India and I remember there was this like hostel with loads of graffiti all over the wall and um, I was running out of money and so I asked the hostel manager if I could paint on the wall in return for a free stay and he said yeah. And that was the first time that I'd painted since I was at school, like at 16. And honestly, it was just one of those moments where I was like, fuck, like I have to do this with my life. Like this is, this is, this is what I need to do. Right, the painting hearts for Valentine's Day. Right. them as well. Alright. Bye. Good night. Bye. Bye. Cheers. Bye. Bye. Good? Good. Okay, cool. That's so shit. <laughs> <laughs> you never know which key this is. He does every time. Cool. I'm just popped home because I need to feed the birds. It's a very important part of my day. Again, I don't know which fucking key it is. <laughs> Where are my little birdies? They're showing me up now. Coco! Oh, they're showing me up now. I bought them. I've got your macadamias! Bought them these expensive macadamias because, you know, they deserve it. And I only like bring them out on special occasions. Normally they just get almonds. Oh, there they are. Hello! Embarrassing. Like I've got the expensive nuts as well. So right now we are taking an Uber to my new warehouse. There's absolutely nothing in there right now and it's a bit overwhelming like I don't really know like what to do with the space or like where to put things but yeah you'll see. Get off my property! <laughs> <laughs> nice outfit. I had a chicken laxa in it so chicken <laughs> and now it's, so just... it's paint it's just paint well yeah that's what i mean yeah <laughs> okay so here it is <sighs> i think i'm going to put like one of those um fingerprint locks on this because i'm just going to lose this key piano so this is the main space it's very echoey right now the actual best part about this entire building actually come with me so it's got like these tannoys throughout on all three levels and at the big car park at the back, it's got these massive speakers. When Sophie Art is like a team of like a thousand people, I can be like, Hello, hello, welcome everyone, welcome. I'm going to have to work out how to use that. It says the fire alarm has gone off. 
the main space. Um, have no idea what we're going to do in here yet, but there's a world of possibility. Down the bottom are the two pieces that I'm releasing on Sunday. Um, I'm doing a, a double heart print for Valentine's Day. At the moment, they've had the first layer. I kind of know where the colours are going, but they're not popping. They don't look like banging yet. I've got a bit of work to do. Very basic bitch right now. They need popping. Right, so I'm thinking, because it's just like such a vast open space, I want to add some like levels and interest. So imagine if there was to be like some stairs, 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 literally the entire length of that pillar to this pillar onto like a mezzanine platform. And the platform is like this entire square and then there's stairs back down. And then underneath we can have some space for storage because obviously we need more space. So glass, 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 maybe like a one-way glass, like an interview room. That's actually a good idea, isn't it? This space here, I'm gonna have as like the casual lounge area. This is the corridor. This is a massive thing for me. There are toilets here. In the last, in the shop in Manly, no toilets and I had to keep running to the public bathroom. And I'm really trying to like make an effort to be healthy and like drink more water. And like, obviously that was just like a massive pain in the ass because like the round trip was five minutes. Here, there's toilets and there's a female and male toilet. So this is the office area. I'm gonna put the, yeah, the marketing girls in here. I'm gonna get Nicole, who's our head girl in Sydney. I'm gonna get like a big corner desk. I'm actually gonna take one of these window panes out and put a big slide down. I just wanna make it like an adventure playground. Um, another toilet. <laughs> Next level. This needs to be white, doesn't it? Big painting up there would be cool. This room is going to be the photo studio. So, what are those walls called again? Psych. Psych, Psych walls. You know, the ones that are like. Um, I'm gonna hopefully get like a bar built for here and have like loads of alcohol, even though I don't drink. And then this bit round here, I'm thinking potentially, so we've pushed a lot of work through the framer and they're running out of space at their studio. So I think they're just gonna kind of um, overlap the work that they're doing for us in, in this space. And a shower here. Um, It? Car park! Obviously like it needs to actually like park cars but also I kind of just want to like get an Uber here and get everyone to just get a taxi so I can just like make this into a pretty little garden. Imagine if this is like fake grass and there's like a big like bunting here and there's like a big like archway and a little hot tub here and I really want to keep showing you the bits as we as we keep build, adding to it. I'm sure it would be like quite a long process so yeah get this sale done for Sunday and then I can afford to make it nice. Woo! Okay guys, that's it for this week. Um, I hope you enjoyed the warehouse tour. I like, honestly, just like so excited to get this place actually a working studio and not just like two campuses at one end of this like totally unnecessary space. But yeah, uh, see you next week, bye.